so I thought today I would take you with me shopping. I have been stuck in the house for the past few days with a migraine headache. I finally got some Excedrin last night and I think that done the trick. I don't know um, what's going on. I'm pretty sure it's my sinuses because um, I have so much sinus pressure just backed up. But um, we are going to Bath and Body Works and Hobby Lobby today. So <clears throat> my husband told me to get out of the house. So, um, that's what we're going to do. Look what was in the mailbox. It's hot. It's very hot. Whew. I gotta take all my... I still have my patriotic stuff up on my porch. But I figured it's okay until, um, Labor Day. What you think? I don't know. So, what we're going to look for... Today is, let me get off this rough road. Anyway, what we are looking for at Bath and Body Works is going to be some wallflowers. They are on sale today for $3.50, plus I have a $10 off of $30, making it $20. So I'm gonna get some fall scents. <clears throat> Nothing but fall scents because last time I got, I think like universal scents. So I need some fall and we're in a Hobby Lobby because their fall stuff <clears throat> has been um, marked down to 40% off sorry about the, the sun um, it's been marked to 40% off and I sent somebody haul a plaid scarf which is what I wanted last year and could never find one so um, I'm gonna look for one of those maybe pick up some fall stuff I'm trying to incorporate some teal in my fall decorations um, because teal is like our house color, if that makes any sense. It's like our overall accent color for like the whole house. Um, our front door is like a teal, turquoisey blue. I don't know. Um, so I want to incorporate some of that and I can leave some of my teal decorations out. I thought that would be nice. I also need some orange pillow covers which I'm hoping H&M um, will eventually post their fall colored decorations um, because they're really the only place I've ever found online that has the 20 by 20 pillow covers or 24 by 24 I can't remember what size they are um, but that's who I got my pillow covers from that's on there now um, so they had Christmas ones last year and I should have ordered them when I first seen them because when I went back they were all out of stock and I never restocked them back because I look like every day. So um, I need some pillows for the season so I'm going to keep looking on H&M. If y'all have any recommendations for a company that sells 20 or 20 by 24 or whatever um, pillow covers let me know. Um, I looked on it. Excuse me. I looked on Amazon last year and I didn't really have any look. I didn't I didn't trust them because it, it seemed to me a lot of them was coming from China and different stuff like that. And I was like, mm -mm. it'll be Valentine's Day before I get these pillowcases. And I've been so upset. So, um, I liked H&M. The quality is really good. And I got them for like 4 or $5 a piece. The ones that I got on my couch now. And like I said, they're really good. They're really um, durable. They're made out of really good material. The zippers are good. So, I really like the ones from H&M glad I'm getting out of the house. I do have a um, closet declutter video that I plan on doing um, probably tomorrow. Today I'm probably actually going to film, which I have to get cream of chicken. Remember, I get cream of chicken. I'm going to film my um, chicken and wild rice soup um, recipe because I talked about it in my last Dollar Tree haul and everybody was like, yes, I want that recipe. Please do that. So I'm going to do that for dinner tonight. So I'm going to film that, which you will probably see before this. Um, and what else? What else? Oh, and the declutter, the, the closet declutter video I'm going to do tomorrow, which you will also see before this. So those will all be going up next week, which technically when you're watching this, it'll be before. So, yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are here.
Bath and Body Works. Now I'm just gonna pop over to Dollar Tree because my mama is looking for some plates for her dining room table for fall decorations. Of course, we always sit up our table. So I'm just gonna see if, if I can find some plates for her because she didn't have any look at her Dollar Tree. So I don't know how I am about Dollar Tree. I really haven't planned on going in here, but she asked me to. <laughs> Dollar Tree it took mama forever mama if you're watching this it took you forever to respond back to me about which plates you wanted I literally put two different colors in my shopping cart thing and she wanted a different one I was like mama I changed it twice first I put white in and then she texted me and said she wanted teal and I told her I was like I don't what if you don't like the teal and she's like okay get me the white so then I'd already started putting teal in the shopping cart and I had to take the teal back out and put the white back in Anyway, and that line, y'all seen that line. There was only one person working and it was the store manager. And he was on the phone with somebody about filling out an application. <laughs> so obviously he needs some more workers up in there. We here, peoples. We are here. We got me, lobby. We got me, lobby. Are you excited? Well, you should be, because I'm excited. I looked at their fall stuff last time I was in here, but not really. I wasn't trying to get myself too excited because, you know, stuff wasn't on sale yet. Never buy anything in Hobby Lobby unless it's on sale. Word to your mother. have a sinus infection which might be why um, it hasn't lift because you know you have to take um, prescription like to get it out of your system so if my head doesn't quit hurting by Friday I'm probably going to make an appointment to our family doctor and see what's going on last time I had an ear infection and early stages of a sinus infection so um, that might be that might be what it is so, if that is, I have to get, um, I think she called it a Z pack. So, they have to call it in, call me in a prescription, and I go pick it up. So, because I'm having like real light sensitivity, this has been happening since Saturday. Um, but I took, like I said, I took Excedrin migraine last night and it stopped hurting but it's like every day around this time it starts hurting and 
I've taken my sinus medicine, so I don't, unless it's, like I said, a sinus infection, because all of this is sore. My water is still cold. And it's been sitting in the car. Yeah. Wanted to show y'all these cute little ice cubes. I don't know if you can see them. That I found at the Dollar Tree. They have water in them. And I just put them in the freezer to freeze them. Because um, our water is different. Like I don't know how to explain it. I think it's just we're not used to it. Because like I said if you've been watching before. Um, we are new to the area that we're in, and um, we're used to our water back at home. <laughs> and they say, like, our neighbors and stuff who've lived here forever say that we have the best water. Um, like, it's like a godsend. Like, it is awesome. But when we taste it, we feel like we taste a an aftertaste of, like, salt. Like, a bitterness. And I think it's because we are near the ocean so i'm thinking that's what it is but we've never gotten used to it um our children will get used to it because of course that will be the first water that they ever taste so they'll be used to it but we buy um bottled water and like gallons of water so even the ice and we have filters we've tried everything um even the ice, you know, once the ice melts inside your drink, it starts having that weird, bitter taste. And it's not, like, ridiculously strong, but you can definitely tell a difference. So, um, yeah, we just... So, I got those. So, when they start to melt, you know, it actually doesn't melt inside my drink. So, I thought it was pretty cool. Alright, guys. I'm done rambling. That is it for my Shop With Me video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this kind of video, definitely hit the like button and comment down below. I'll start taking you along with me. I wanted to do a different vlog other than just going home. Because <laughs> um, that's normally what we do every weekend. Not every weekend, but you know. We, didn't, we normally have something going on. So, I wanted to do something a little different for this week's vlog. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. And thanks for watching.